you all for coming out. This is a very special occasion. And I do lead cheers, I also dance. Neither one is a pretty sight. And I look out in the audience and I see very familiar faces, many who trek to uh, Macon for that exciting tournament that uh, we emerged victorious in. It's, uh, I can't say enough. I can't say enough about the heart that these ladies display and the commitment that our coaches and our very fine fans have towards your success. So I understand it's St. Bonaventure. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. In Tallahassee. Yeah. Yeah. Joanna and I, we were on, get this, we were online, she was, last night, and we were making reservations in Tallahassee and Baton Rouge. <laughs> so tonight we will have to go home, meaning Joanna, and uh, cancel those reservations in Baton Rouge. But I assure you, we will be there. I will be cheering, and I will be dancing, and I look out in this audience, I know a lot of y'all will be there. Yeah. Okay, this is my last thing. Can I get a Go Eagles on three? One, two, three! All right, I know another question you're gonna ask is what do you know about St. Bonaventure? And all I know is that they're really good, uh, they're, you know, one of the best mid-major programs in the country, uh, but so are we. So, uh, so it's going to be a great matchup, and we're really excited about it. Uh, the first thing I, I would like to do, if you don't mind, is have my assistant step up here. There's a lot of times where uh, we do well, and, you know, players get a lot of credit. I get a lot of credit, but uh, it's a lot of hard work from our assistant coaches and uh, they have to put up with me all year, and they'll be smiling when I say that. But uh, I would like to just recognize them for all the efforts that they did to uh, put us in this place. Uh, you'll have to look up here, because I... And just to make myself look worse, uh, they're up there because I told them as soon as they announced the team we were playing, they were to start downloading some videos so that when we were done, I would have it, have it ready. So thank you guys for the hard work and make sure the video is ready. Guys, this has been a great, you know, 10, 11 years, but this has really been a special team to work with right here. Uh, you know, from the first game this year, right in Aliko Arena, where we beat Michigan State. <laughs> through an undefeated A-Sun regular season. And then with all the pressure of being the number one seed at the conference tournament, especially, you know, we've, we've been waiting for four years. We had to sit out waiting for an opportunity to be in that tournament, thinking we had a team good enough to win that tournament, be in that NCAA tournament. Uh, to make sure that we made the most of our opportunity really meant a lot to everyone in here. Uh, now there's a couple people that I'm going to let talk who you'd rather hear speak than me. And that's two kids that about five years ago uh, I recruited to this program and they came here knowing that they would only have one chance at an NCAA tournament and that would be their senior year here. And I told them, hey, I think we got a team good enough to go to the NIT. And by the time that NCAA tournament comes around, I think we'll have a team that can be there. Um, and fortunately, they believed in that dream. And they came to FGCU. And uh, our program and our university has benefited from that ever since. And those two kids are Kelsey Jacobson and Courtney Chihill. to us to see all of you guys out here um, you know we, we've been here four years now and uh, I, <laughs> I mean I think right there shows how much you guys mean to us um, 
I couldn't have said it better myself. I mean, we've been here for four years, and you guys have been some of the best fans, and we are so happy to have you guys here with us today and sharing this moment with us that we've been waiting for. And I hope that you guys can all make it out to Tallahassee. Yeah. to play the best game possible so we can get a win for you guys and make you guys proud. Yeah.